In New at Six, school libraries across the country are under fire as the debate over what books should be banned from your child's schools heats up. In Virginia Beach City Public Schools and Chesapeake Public Schools, there is one book in particular that school leaders decided has no place in the classroom. Dana Smith has more. Tucked away on Main Street is a cozy bookstore that's a downtown Norfolk staple. Almost 40 years. <laughs> From modern biographies to classic titles, Prince Books has a little of everything. But there's one display that stands out. These have the LBGTQ content. Behind bright yellow caution tape and a sign that says banned are books that at some point were off limits in schools across the country. You know, everything got so crazy with the people, you know, wanting to ban books that I thought we're going to just pull this thing out and put it up now. Sarah Pishko, the owner of Prince Books, puts the display up every year, but this time it has a little more meaning. There's one book in particular that school leaders at Virginia Beach City Public Schools and Chesapeake Public Schools removed from libraries. It's a bestseller on Amazon and Barnes and Noble. It's a story about gender identity. It's called Gender Queer. It showed explicit um, sexual scenes. And I think that people, when you say sexually explicit, they don't understand how sexually explicit, like rated X. Virginia Beach City Public School Board member Victoria Manning petitioned for school leaders to remove gender queer. After a review, they agreed. In this letter from school board chair Carolyn Rye, Rye writes, I will direct staff to remove gender queer from school division libraries. Over at Chesapeake Public Schools, assistant principal for instruction at Great Bridge High School, Elizabeth Haskins, wrote in a letter to a parent. As a result of review, the book will be removed from circulation. If an adult wants to look at pornographic materials, I am not about banning books. They can go get those books. They're, these books are still available at the public library. So I'm just asking that minors not be given these books in our schools. Dana Smith, 13 News Now. There are other books in Virginia Beach City public schools that people are challenging, including a book series called Saga and another title called A Court of Mist and Fury. Both have sexual content. For more information on those books and genderqueer, search Banned Books on 13newsnow.com.